Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Olivia, and for today's video is sort of like a back to school haul. I actually, my move-in date is August 13th, so that's why this video is going to be coming out shortly because I actually am going to school sooner than high schoolers or elementary school or middle schoolers because I'm going to college. So without further ado, let's get on to this video. So before I begin with the video, I just want to give two little disclaimers. One, apologies for the mess. Um, I actually have a new pet with me, which will be introduced in another video. Um, so I have a lot of the pet supplies in my room. And then also I have the stuff for my dorm room in my room as well. So everything's kind of like jam packed. It's really hard to walk in my room actually, but I just want to give that little disclaimer and then my other disclaimer was that I will not be showing everything first of all I don't have everything for my dorm room but second of all there's a lot that I already have and I don't want to make this video very long so I'm only going to show like my necessities and my basics that I have and maybe some little fun things but yeah all right so the first thing I'm going to start with is actually my school backpack which is this Fial Raven Kinkin backpack from Urban Outfitters and that's what it looks like in the sides and then that's what the back looks like and then I'll unzip the front so you guys can actually see what it looks like on the inside that's what it looks like yeah um I do have two backpacks just because sometimes Fial Raven Kinkin backpacks can be a pain to handle and you know, if I'm running late or whatever, I can just throw everything into this bag, which I actually got from Romley many years ago. I think like maybe two or three years ago, but that's just what it looks like. It's just a normal backpack. I got it because it reminded me of Harry Potter. And if you know, I have a huge obsession with Harry Potter. And then whew, that's what the inside looks like. It's really hard to see since it's like pretty dark, but there's a laptop holder and then it's just a bunch of open space and stuff so yeah those are my school backpacks all right so the next thing i got is just this white lamp um it's just a regular desk lamp it has a plug you plug it in and then you just click this and it turns on and then it has a little space here where you can charge your phone and stuff and then it just has a bunch of storage it's hard to see because it's white but i got white because it would be easier to you know match things with because my comforter which i will show you later on in the video my comforter is actually maroon and i feel like it's maroon white and gold so that was the big statement of my room so i wanted to match things with it so i figured the white i could match with anything because i'm gonna do the maroon but i'm also gonna add like a dusty pink color or a dusty rose color in between so i figured the white would kind of pull it together and the walls are also white and my room does come with a desk but it's just like a light wood desk so i figured this wouldn't blend it would blend well but it wouldn't like physically like blend in blend in so yeah okay so the next thing i'm going to show you guys are my pillows now i do have a lot of pillows so i'm just going to show you three big ones um this one is actually from target it's this long white pillow you know going along with the white theme also my lighting is kind of bad in my room right now because it's like 11 in the morning so i do apologize for that but yeah going along with the white theme and then i have this pillow right here for my dorm room as well it's also white um both of these are actually from target and then my favorite pillow of all time is this one from costco it kind of it blends in with the white too but it's this it says autumn harvest farm fresh pick your own i got it from costco it was 11 dollars or 10.99 but when i tell you fall is my favorite season i mean fall is my favorite season like it's the perfect weather you can still wear like skirts and short sleeve shirts and just have like a jacket or something or like tights like oh i'm gonna make a whole different video of like clothes that i bought and like different accessories and stuff but like this is my favorite pillow that I have. I'm actually bringing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight pillows, I believe. So <laughs> I sleep with a lot of pillows and a lot of stuffed animals. Uh, you may think I'm crazy, but 
you know. Okay, so the next thing I'm bringing, it's not really a necessity, it's more of a want, but I bought this skincare fridge. I think it's, yeah, it's by Flawless. I only opened it out of the packaging once, uh, just to make sure it worked and everything, but this is from Amazon. It was, I believe it was $50, and then I got it on sale for about $30, I believe. Um, also, like, full disclaimer, um, about 85 to 90% of the stuff that was bought, I bought with my own money. I'm very grateful that I have the money uh, for my job, and I'm also very grateful that my parents did buy some stuff. And um, a lot of the stuff I bought, I bought with my graduation money. So, like, my family and friends for graduation gave me, like, checks or gift cards or just cash or anything. So, I just want to say that I'm incredibly grateful, and in no way I am trying to brag about money or anything like that but yeah this is my skincare fridge all right so the next thing is actually a fun thing it's from rm studio and fun space fun yeah fun space sorry um it's actually from it's a seller on amazon and this is what the packaging looks like um and then when you open it there's styrofoam i did have to put this back in its box just because i was scared i was gonna break it but for the longest time I wanted a flower vase and I didn't really know what to get like I'm gonna get a different one too but this one caught my eye and I wanted it for my birthday but I didn't get it so I kept it on my list to buy for college and this is what it looks like it, it, it's so pretty like and then on the inside that's just what it looks like but you can put like flowers you can put pencils pens whatever um, they suggest if you do put flowers or something in here no. I don't think you can put water in this um but if you put like fake flowers they want you to put like um it's like a green foam type thing you can get at like a craft or anything so then your flowers look more kind of like opened I don't know the exact way that they said it but yeah it's so cute though and then the next thing that I got um also from Amazon a lot of this is actually from Amazon um, I got these pink smiley face slippers. I've actually been wearing them a lot recently, but I got them because, you know, they were trendy, but I've also wanted them for a while, so yeah. All right, so the next thing I'm going to show you guys is my trash can, and yes, there is stuff inside of it. Uh, the trash can itself is from Bed Bath & Beyond. This bag I got when I went shopping at Fabletics, and I got some leggings, um, and then inside it is just... Brita filters because I do have a Brita filter, um, index cards, sharpies, tape, glue sticks, highlighters, all that stuff. Um, this is stuff I've already had. I just put in here because I'm not using it at all and I wanted to make sure that I remembered it while I thought of it. And then because I am pursuing a theater track, I have my character heels. I wore these during when I did Alice in Wonderland. I'm not going to pull the other one out, but this is what they look like. They're like a caramel type um, with the T-strap, and I believe they're a one and a half to a two inch. But yeah, they're from the brand Blotch. I got them at an actual dance store. I was going to get a three inch heel because that's what they suggested, but it's really hard to dance in a three inch heel. Because I also, I wore these for Matilda when I was mom one in miracle and then when i was a loud dancer i wore these along with black jazz shoes so yeah all right so the next item i'm going to show you is also from costco and i got this on sale and it's this big blue fluffy blanket from berkshire life eco soft um basically i got this about Almost two months ago, um, it was on sale. It was originally $40 and it was on sale for $17. And then I went back to Costco the other day and it was on sale for like $10. But hey, you win some, you lose some. And it was still like a deal anyways. But like, it's so freaking soft. Like, if you guys, I don't know if you can see this, but like, oh my God, it's so soft. And I'm, I'm the type, type of girl that loves to just cuddle up in like a million blankets regardless of what temperature it is in my room i will sleep with at least three blankets like big blankets plus a heated blanket and a weighted blanket 
so i do have my weighted blanket actually it's behind me but it has to get washed first but yeah all right so the next two things i'm going to show you one is from michael's and the other is from target the one i'm just about to show you is from michael's and it is this three tier rolling cart in the color turquoise it's so pretty now i know i said my theme was maroonish but originally i was gonna do blue but I am so indecisive that I was like, oh, this is pretty, this is pretty, this is pretty. Not realizing that it was going to clash with each other. So I took some stuff back and got a different color in them, like the pillows I showed you earlier. But I'm thinking about taking this back and getting like a red if they have one. Or I don't really want to get a white, but like if they have a different color that would match my room more. But I do really like the teal, but or the turquoise, but I just, I, my favorite color is blue, and I love all different shades of blue, but I am so indecisive, and I did not plan out what I wanted my dorm colors to be in enough time for me to be settled on it and have enough time to change it if I wanted to. So when we went shopping, it was Saturday, it was a different Saturday, but when we went shopping, oh my God, I literally just threw things in the cart and be like, oh, this is cute, this is cute, this is cute. And then before we went to check out, I was like, nah, I don't want that, I don't want that. But then it was like, I'm left with all of these blues and it's just like, this, they're gonna clash together and it's just, it's a big mess. But yeah, so that's actually from Michaels and then, oh, the second thing is from Target, like I said earlier, and it is this floor lamp, which was $15, and the picture is what it looks like, and it's just silver. It's really nothing to it. It's a floor lamp. I love light. <laughs> Need light. Like, it's not very, I mean, it's practical, but it's not very interesting for that matter but yeah all right so the next few things i'm going to show you are also from target and i have this set of pillowcases with the matching teal sheets <sighs> i don't know my mom is like you should have at least two good pairs of sheets so this could be one and then i'm thinking about getting like a maroon pair so it would match my comforter but like I said, I'm very indecisive. Uh, the next thing I got from Target are these teal measuring cups because I like to bake. Don't really know what I'm going to make considering I'll be a college student with not a lot of money, but I do like to bake and occasionally cook. Uh, I'm just gonna go in random order. This is from Bad Bath & Beyond. It's just a black, shower caddy actually i think this is from target actually i don't know at this point i'm just gonna say whatever at this point uh the next thing tie pods i'm speeding through this because it's not really important i mean it's important but they're not fun essentially uh but just tie pods and i have very sensitive skin so i got the sensitive ones the next thing alarm clock because for the life of me I cannot wake myself up in time for anything uh, and then just simple plates with the matching bowls and matching cups these are the ones that are like 50 cents at Target so they're not a big deal and then these two I know are from Staples I got a stapler and some pens I have a bunch of school supplies I'm just not gonna go through everything and then this is also from Target. It's just like a mixing bowl. And then the last two things in this little speed round is from Amazon. Uh, first, going with the fall theme, we have some fall leaves. Actually, I can't find them for the life of me. I think they're in a bin somewhere. But I did get vines, like you can see in the corner over here by my photos. There's uh, the regular green vines. I did buy those again for my dorm room. And then finally in the speed round is a tapestry because you know I can't go without it but like speaking with the Harry Potter this is the tapestry I got it's just a small Harry Potter tapestry it's like the little like uh pink colored I think that's what it, the right name is sorry I'm speeding through this but uh, it was $12.99 on Amazon 
yeah all right so i have three things left to show you guys and they're all big things so the first thing is actually from target and along with all the cooking stuff i got all of this so it comes with ooh, two pots two pans a spatula a spoon thing and i can't see what the other one is this was originally $40 sorry I'm out of breath I had to go downstairs and get these um, but this was originally $40 and it was on sale for $27 so it's not the best deal but I've been looking for a pot everywhere and I don't want to spend $50 on one pot or one pan so I got this one and then the next thing I got is actually from Amazon the box is so messed up but it's not actually messed up I got this Dusty Rose Kirk machine and then I'm going to get, this is the mini one, I'm going to get the Swiss Miss uh, hot chocolate cake cups from Michael's or Staples, Staples, excuse me, because they're cheaper there and they seem to be the only place that sells them besides Amazon and Amazon is like really expensive, but yeah. All right, so the last thing I'm gonna show you, which is my favorite thing of all time, and it is the staple of my room, which is my comforter. But it's not just any comforter. It's a Harry Potter themed comforter. And it's not just any Harry Potter themed comforter. <laughs> I bought this with one of my paychecks because um, it is quite expensive, but this is what it looks like. Um, if I can, I'll insert a picture of what it actually looks like because I'm using a new editing app, so I still need to figure out how to insert stuff. But this is from Pottery Barn Team, and it was $150 with shipping and everything. It got here within about two weeks, I believe, because it was like 10 business days or something it took, um, and I did regular shipping. So there was a code where you would get free shipping on your first order and you would get a certain percentage off or a certain amount of money off your first order as well. So you get free shipping and I think like 20 or $30 off as well. So when I placed it, cause this is a twin for just like a regular twin because the beds at Sweetbriar are twins, not twin XL like normal colleges are or normal college beds are they're actually just regular twins like the bed I'm sitting on right now is a twin so it's nothing different other than it's a metal frame not a wooden bed frame but yeah normally when I put it into the card it was $181 I believe $184 something like that and then with free shipping and the certain amount of money off it only ended up being $150 so it was about half of my paycheck or one of my paychecks at least but so you guys can't tell a i love harry potter and b my room is going to be harry potter themed so um yeah just oh my god i'm so happy right now i like can't even form words like, all right so that is everything or not really everything that is some of the stuff i got for my dorm room for college i don't know why i'm really excited it's also really hot in here right now but I'm happy. I'm nervous to be moving in in less than two weeks, but I'm happy at the same time. And um, I also will be bringing a ton of stuff from home. Literally most of my Harry Potter stuff, apart from like a few things, like the really expensive things. Like I have uh, the Diadem of Ravenclaw and the personalized trunk from Platform 9 and 3 quarters. Um, those two things I definitely won't be bringing because they're too expensive and they mean too much to me and I just don't want to risk it and I do have a single dorm I have the medical exemption thing that I have a single dorm and my room is I believe 144 square feet it's 16 by 9 I believe it's the biggest room like not the biggest because the thing is they are actually making rooms because there's a lot more kids this year than normal years have been so they actually are taking apart their common area or their common room and making other rooms and then making a different part of the place or different part of the dorm building be the common room because I'm on the third floor 
and there are elevators which i'm so happy about there are stairs as well um each floor has a common room and a kitchen which is nice but i don't know i'm just i'm so excited i'm so happy and it's just like i can't wait you know and it's nerve-wracking but I feel like I found my school and yeah it's gonna be sad leaving home it's gonna be hard I'm gonna be homesick a lot of the time but you know unfortunately that is part of growing up and I'm 18. I'm an adult. I graduated high school on June 7th of 2022. Class of 2022. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to comment and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.